Look, Stanley, if you're here to beg me again to go to that reception, forget it. Hey, Stanley's born act does not beg, okay? I'm a man. I have my self-respect, my dignity. Then why are you here? I need you to tie my tie. <laughs> Come on, Stanley. I don't know how to do it, all right? The Japanese are going to be insulted if they think I already did my Sinatra impression. <laughs> are you going to help me or not? This reminds me of the first time I ever did this. Night of our senior prom. <laughs> yeah, remember? Took so long to get the tie fixed. By the time I got to the drugstore, it was closed. I remember. Mm. I remember. Die, Dorothy! <laughs> remember our wedding day? I made you do this, even though you thought it'd be bad luck for me to see you before the ceremony. Yeah. What a silly superstition. You know, Dorothy, all those years of marriage, through all the struggles, the one thing I wanted was to be a success. Suddenly I have all the success I want, and it scares me. I keep waiting for a knock at the door. Hi, it's me, failure. And I'm scared to face it alone. What I'm trying to say is, I need your help, Dorothy, like I did when we were together. So, what do you think? I hate to admit it, but you look good. Well, wish me luck. Uh, Stanley, why don't you come back here in about an hour? Why? It'll take me a while to get ready. Oh, thank you, Dorothy. <laughs> Besides, I'll need someone to fasten my pearls. Oh, babe. The ones I gave you? No, sweetheart. The real ones. <laughs> to me again, Blanche. Rose, look, if there's $500,000 in the statue fund, why can't they just take 50000 of it to save the town? Because that's the statue money. <laughs> well, there won't be anywhere to put the statue if there's no town left. Wow, a loophole. Oh. Hi, it's me, Dorothy and Stan. Oh, hi. How'd it go? Oh, it was great. Those Japanese sure know how to have fun. <laughs> what was that crazy dance called again? They were bowing, Stanley. <laughs> wild. They were just wild. <laughs> they loved you, Dorothy. No, they loved you. Except, of course, for those Hirohito jokes. <laughs> Too soon? Rose, do you think we can go and call St. Olaf now and you can explain it to them the way I explained it to you? Well, we could try. We might not be able to get a hold of anybody. It's everybody hide the corn day. <laughs> It was a perfect reception. For once, everything was perfect. It was you, babe. No. You charmed them. You were pretty impressive yourself. You gave them a respectable soft sell, and you made a deal that's going to profit both sides. You've come a long way, Sporny. Thanks, babe. Well, I, I better be going. It was a good evening. Spornak and Spornak. What a team. <laughs> Maybe we can do it again sometime. Maybe. Thanks, babe. Dorothy. Dorothy, you're gonna send me to an early grave. <laughs> Too late, Ma. Good night. <laughs>